Welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming, where we have a voice inside your head. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Don. I'm Mike the Explosive One, and we're playing Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Got a new outfit. What is this thing? It looks like Sasuke. Was it? <laughs> Honestly, you're not even wrong. Kind of trench coaty. Uh, it's a suspicious replica of the green outfit once worn by the legendary he hero. So it's like dark Zelda outfit? Yeah, but I don't, I don't know what it does. I mean... It has high defense or something? I don't know. This has better defense. We're gonna go bippy top it out. We're in bippy topping it. Uh, do I just talk to you again? At this point, you've gathered the five sages together and returned the master sword to your to your side. All we have to do now is locate the demon king. Sorry, let me gather my thoughts here. I think I can't think of anywhere to start. Okay, we already did this. You're, you have to talk to Joshua, who was underneath. Yeah. I thought I. Well, why didn't she start up a conversation the two times that she was interrupting me down here talking? Oh yeah, it's you. Okay. So remember that fragment I had, the one that showed a single mysterious figure. I found more figures among the things our survey team brought back from the depths, and guess what? They fit together like a puzzle. Hey. Ta-da, just look. Oh, yeah, I do remember this. Feast your eyes upon this amazing mural. Ooh. The scene shows that there is a whole series of statues down there, like the ones you found for me last time. But uh, what they really caught my attention is the way they're uh, oriented. Each figure is pointed towards the next one in a series. Until the end with the last statue facing the final destination, a building that looks like a temple. Mm. Also, see those their large ears on the figure at the front of the building. That's got to be one of the Zoni. And then there's that last strange hand symbol that seems to be uh, responding to whatever the Zoni is doing. Uh -huh. Okay, so to collect my thoughts on all of this, I'm pretty sure if you follow the gaze of each of those statues down there, you'll reach the structure. I'm also betting that the temple-like building holds something of, Z of Zonai origin. I've heard that the Zonai wielded mysterious powers. I wonder if the uh, if this correlates to those powers. Of course, all of this is just speculation on my part. So... That's where you come in, swordsman. I want you to find the temple structure dis depict in the, depicted in the mural. Uh, initially, I figured I could just go myself, so I gathered a bunch of, of bright, bright blooms and supplies. Aww. But they are, but they pulled the kid card on me and I said I couldn't go into the depths. So here, you take them. Oh, ooh, ten giant boys? You can have these two. Even bigger boys and bigger arrows. arrows. I do need arrows. Bright blooms and arrows, perfect for exploring the depths. All right, cool. Uh, I heard something about the potential sighting of Princess Zelda at the castle, but I need to stay focused on my research into the depths. There, uh... That's where you'll find me, find a real clue about what's happening to the princess. So if it all works out, maybe you'll snag some mysterious power for yourself and, uh, uh -oh. you know, get some clues or something. Nothing but good things, right? Thanks for your help, swordsman. A mystery in the depths. I literally just left the depths. Um, the dark tunic. <laughs> yeah. If you wear the whole set, you move 20% faster at night. That's awesome. Yeah, but it has low defense. You mean to tell me that you already found the temple? Oh, I did, as a matter of fact. And what was in there? You know, there's like some stuff and some stuff. Auto build? Yeah, I already got that. Well, the ability to instantly replicate things that you've already built in Schema Stones? Yeah, I got one of those. Uh, so there was a Zonai temple housing a mysterious power down in the depths. Yes. Hmm, this might also mean that some of the things collected from the depths may give us other clues. Wait, here are, wait here just a sec. I don't think this is who I'm talking, supposed to talk to. Hmm, not just, nope, not that either. Aha, here we go. I think this is a different quest, is what I'm getting I at I thought here. she said talk to Joshua. I thought she did too, but I may be wrong. Another schema stone, baby. What does this one give me the power to build? Hot air balloon. Oh boy, I give a shit. 
You can fly. Uh... This is a schema zone for a balloon, right? So if you use the auto build, you could replicate the balloon, right? I'm thinking. I'm thinking. thinking. <laughs> <laughs> that balloon over there belongs to goggles, but it's been broken. Do you think you can uh, fix it up with your auto build? Sure, I'll give it a shot. Give me, uh, let me at her. Yeah, this is this is a different, this is a different quest, but it's fine. We'll do it. Swordsman, everything is ready. Please demonstrate the auto build replicate replicating things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut up. No, it's updated. Mystery in the depths. Yeah, okay, yep. Maybe. So it's just part of the plan, man. I guess. Maybe you just have to. Yeah, build that zombie. Oh, that's, that's a nice hot air balloon, by the way. It is way nicer than I would have ever been able to put together. I can't believe it. You built the balloon in an instant. Yep, sure did. Super easy, Joshua. This is mysterious power goes beyond scientific explanation. I agree. Goggles! G goggles! What are you yelling about, Joshua? Inconceivable. My balloon is fixed. That must mean the mysterious power, uh, the zone I had. I never thought that I'd see such a marvel with my very own eyes. Thank you for making this reality. Please take this. I've been saving it for a special action. Oh. They're giving you all sorts of stuff that, like, I think you would have had a long time ago. I still haven't uh, been able to figure out what this is. By judging its light, it's got to be Zonai and Origin. Yeah, yeah, it makes battery stuff. Uh, since you can use Zonai powers, I think it would be better if you had it. There's an incredible power line hidden in the depths, after all. I think the researching the depths is going forward. Who knows? I might even find a clue about Princess Zelda. Yeah, we know this already, man. A mystery into the depths. Okay, we did it. Um, yes, you need something, swordsman? No, I need you to stop with the words. <laughs> no way. Koga, Leaguer of the Yiga clan was there? Oh, that's dangerous. I've got <laughs> rain in my composure. Okay, come this way. Bro, this lady is killing me right now. <laughs> just yep, like, she uh, just wants to keep telling you stuff. Like murdering me with dialogue. So you face Koga in the depths. Hmm, what's the leader of the Yiga clan up to down there? From what I know, the Yiga clan is the super dangerous group that schemes against the kingdom of Hyrule. And Koga has had it out for you and Princess Zelda for a long time. Uh, he'd do anything to see an end to your lives. Despite everything, he's looking into... Already, we just uh, can't take our eyes off this threat. Besides, Koga could could know what's happened to the princess. That would make a lot of sense. If only you, if you do go after him, keep in mind that he. Uh, I'll be continuing my research in the depths. Okay, cool. Oh, by the way, do you know about the forest of time south of Hyrule? I don't. Do I probably? Uh, another series of statues found at the bottom. Okay. There's statues that are from different, uh, places. You can use your camera. I should be using the camera more. Like they we seem, haven't used it at all. Like, at all. They seem to point in the, <laughs> in the way somewhere to and come near where you got your auto build ability. But don't stop there. These statues lead further southwest into the depths. Okay, so we actually do need to follow to the Koga boy. Um, beyond that building, I am going to skip the rest of this because I am tired of... Okay, well, there was only one <laughs> more... There was one more. There was only one more yeah, sentence there. Uh, okay, that was a lot. Holy crap. I hate that. I don't like talking to NPCs in video games. I don't. All right, we're out of here, baby. I need a I need a palate cleanser. I'm not even gonna lie to you, man. Yeah. That like was... there was so much talking and doing stuff and just like vice and just like. I do remember them saying the very so beginning much. that you needed to take photos of stuff, but we just never did. I mean, what do go you fight want? a Linnell then. It's not a Linnell. No, like in general, go fight a Linnell. Okay. Oh, selfie boy. I'm deleting it. I hate myself. <laughs> 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 delete that picture, delete that picture, delete that. Uh, no, I'm not going to fight a Linnell, John. I don't even know where one would be, to be honest. You know where the lightning one is. Do I? On top of the... Old Smokey? The plateau. No, I don't know what that means. 
You said plateau like I was going to be like, oh, yeah, but no, I don't know what you're talking about. Well, never mind then. On top of the plateau. Uh, you know what, Jonas? Remember, I wanted you to fight him like remember 130 episodes ago? Mm. And you were like, no. It's very, it's very strange how little things like, you know, the stuff we did last week, you don't remember. <laughs> you had something from 120 episodes ago. <laughs> I'm like, what do you mean you don't remember that? Duh. You don't remember that one line L from 20 episodes ago, huh? Hey, look, a palate cleanser. We haven't done one of these in a freaking million no, years. It is a shrine. That's a really nice. And apparently we need to go back in the depths anyway, so we'll jump in the hole after the shrine. But God dang it, if I don't need a God dang palate cleanser after all of that dialogue. All right, your boy, just, wa your boy just wants to play the game sometimes. I hope it's a nice one. Can I just play the game? I don't want to read a book. I don't. I don't really read instruction manuals. Yeah, you don't want to read at all. That's funny you say that, but like I've been doing a lot of it. Shape rotation. I'm tempted to just do the episode. I don't even care, but I'm not. I'm not gonna do that. I am gonna do a little bit though. Oh, it's <laughs> showing you how to twist shapes. Is this your what favorite? You're, is this what you're trying to? Is this what we're doing right now? Well, what a palate cleanser. Something you hate to something else you hate. This is super easy, though. You just sneak it through the door, and then you freaking... No, wait. No, you can't. You don't sneak it through there. Duh. Obviously, you take it through the... Bruh. Yeah, get in there. Good enough. Good enough. Good enough. No, you know what? So, like, look. This is going to be so easy that it's going to, like, disgust us. So, let's just get it. Look at, look at how easy... Nope, 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 nope. We want to turn it that it way. It's easy. It's super easy, dude. Look, look at how cakewalk. Done. Boom. We did the shrine. It's done. Deedle deedle deedle. We did it. Okay, look, and there's probably a chest up there. You know what? Look, I think we're going to save the rest of this easy ass shrine for the next episode. So I have a palette cleanse to come through on Monday. And, uh, you know what? I think, I think we did good work today. All right. That's all that we have today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe for Jonas. Two batteries. TNT. Oh, yeah. <laughs> TNT two bats.